30th selection, Indianapolis has chosen wide receiver from Miami, Reggie Wayne. I look at it as if I'm part of the elite of the elite when it comes to coach franchise. It has my name on it, you know, but it, I couldn't do it by myself. I mean, all my teammates and, and, and friends and coaches. And the fans, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be uh, Reggie Wayne at this capacity without them. So just to be a part of it is, 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 is humbling. From the Huntington Bank Studio, this is Colts 365. Of course, it is going to be an exciting weekend. Seeing that video there of yes. Reggie Wayne. Reggie. <laughs> there Reggie. you go. Yeah, get, get ready, Reggie. people out there. You yep. know yep. that chant get it going. is get it going, going to be in Lucas Oil Stadium. It will certainly be an exciting weekend. We're going to get to that in just a minute. But first things first. The Colts, uh, they have a football game to play a this week and a game. very big football game. So we're going to get you ready for that. I'm Caroline Can, as always with Marlon Jackson. Welcome to Colts 365. The Tennessee Titans coming to Lucas Oil Stadium off of a two game win streak. Are we calling that a streak or maybe just yeah, we'll call maybe, it. maybe just back to back back to back wins. wins. Back to maybe back the Colts wins. We don't want to hype them up too yeah, much. Yeah, yeah, the Colts have the win streak, okay? But, That's right, three uh, in a row. Yes. Three in a row. They've got back to back wins coming in yeah. here. Another AFC South division. And really this one's for second place. It's, it's for second place and it's a tough it's a tough opponent. They're playing well right now. They're well coached. They have a lot of talent, especially at the quarterback position. Yep. Anytime you have talent at the quarterback position, you have a great opportunity to win. But the coaching staff right now, I feel, is doing a great job for the Tennessee Titans. So the chess match of coaching, um, it'll be interesting to see who wins on Sunday. It is certainly. I think one thing about the Tennessee Titans this year that maybe we haven't been talking about in years past is their defense. Yes. Their defense this year is making waves. They're tied for sixth um, overall. Maybe if there was one kink, it might be the run game. So uh, being able, if the Colts can get that run game going early, uh, I think it could be another good week for the Colts. It, it can be. And, and, and that's and that's key. I mean, over the three game winning streak that we've seen so far, a key component of that has been the Colts running game. And when you're going up against a stout defense like the Titans, you have to be able to run the football and not put all the pressure on your quarterback to go out there and win the football game. Yeah. So that's going to be essential. It's going to be key. But I mean, I feel good about that. The way the offensive line is played, you know, th those guys have they have it going right now. Anytime you have it going up front, it's a good chance you'll win. Yeah, it has been a lot of fun to watch that Colts offense really start to click on yeah. all cylinders. Mm -hmm. And then we got to give you defense a little bit of a shout out because they've had a turnover in every, I, seems like every that, single That's game. been the key. That's been the key with the defense because, <laughs> you know, we're, we're a little, kind, we're kind of bend but don't break. Yep. But when you, you have a lead and you have the team, you have teams having 10, 11, 12 play drives, eating up that clock, and then you can come up with a turnover in a big moment, in a key moment in the game. I think that's part of our, our winning recipe right Right now with those key turnovers and key moments. Well, Marlon, you mentioned that coaching uh, matchup here this weekend. Here's what head coach Frank Reich had to say about what his team needs to do to get another win in the AFC South. We need to get this pass rush going again. You know, early on the first four games of the year, we got a lot of pressure and a lot of sacks. So um, we got to get that pressure on Marcus Mariota this week. And, and so we're really counting on our guys up front to get that. I think that's a big key. Secondly, you know, we had the run game going. We stalled a little bit. We had that one nice run last week. But let's get that run game going. Um, you know, we don't have to run it 50 times, but let's have a balanced attack um, and keep the and, and just keep these guys at bay, slow them down a little bit against a very good defense. And then thirdly, we need to continue to build off of this momentum that we had last week with the fast start. And I just think that takes a lot of pressure off the defense, gives us a lot of juice. When you can get off to a fast start, um, it gets the crowd into it, gets our players into it. So that's what we're looking to do this week. Well, head coach Frank Reich letting you know what he wants to see his team do this weekend. But I know what Colts fans out there want to see, what I want to see, what Marlon probably wants to see is, yes. of course, Reggie Wayne coming back to town, being inducted into the Ring of Honor. We have a little treat here because uh, you were a teammate <laughs> of his. And not just a I teammate, a teammate. I was about to say, not just a teammate. Marlon Jackson went up against Reggie every, every single every, day. Every single day. I mean, I, I was on his side of the field. I played, I was right corner. He was a left wide receiver, so we we essentially each and every day in practice went up against one another. And I mean, I, I was very thankful for the opportunity to play against such a great wide receiver 
because any time you, anytime you compete against someone that is one of the best, it, it doesn't do anything but elevate your yeah. game. So, you know, going against Reggie on a day-to-day -day basis, you know, in the, in the beginning, I, I lost a lot of those battles, but, but, but by the end, it was, going back, it was going back and forth. And that's uh, the power of team and, and competition. It brings out the best in each and every one of us. And, you know, I'm, I'm thankful for the opportunity that I had to go up against Reggie Wayne on a day-to-day -day basis. You know, when, it talk, when you talk about a wide receiver, m most times we think about a little bit when it comes to the attitude, the mindset, a bit of a prima donna. But Reggie Wayne was never any, any of those <laughs> things. Like, he was a lunch pill guy, like, you know, hard hat. He, he, he came and brought it each and every day. He wasn't looking for a day off from practice. Like, he was literally out there working. And, you know, during our era, that's what made the team so yeah. great was that your best players worked the hardest. You know, and going up against guys like Reggie and competing against him and Peyton, it just made the defense that much better, you know, and, and just his, his route running, his hands. I mean, just the, 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 the ultimate professional, you know, when it came to preparing himself to play and going out there and, and practice, taking it as if it was a game. I mean, okay, you take it as a game. It's really competitive. You gotta tell any, any chippiness, any come on. Oh, definitely chippy. I mean, yeah, come on. of course. Come I mean, on. I'm, I'm a come. I'm, just, I'm a, he's, he's extremely competitive, and I'm <laughs> extremely competitive. So you know, like it, it was definitely chippy, and you know it makes it like I, I I've always had all the respect in the world for Reggie, but when it when you're you know a defensive back and a wide receiver and you go against each other every day, it makes it sometimes hard to be buddy <laughs> buddy 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 buddy. That's just the reality yeah. of it. But you know the reality also is that. We, we pushed one another, like we made each other better, you know, and that's what it's all about at yeah. the end of the day, competing as teammates to help us, each one of us go out there on Sunday and play our best and help the team. And I mean, he did that for me and I tried to do that for him. Well, we hear that from you. I feel like we've heard that from so many different teammates of not only just how Reggie played, but the type of man he was in the locker room. So it will certainly be a wonderful weekend getting Reggie into the ring of honor. Stay tuned for the right stuff as we talk to one of Reggie Wayne's favorite teammates, Robert Mathis. Colts fans, be sure to visit Colts.com to view the most recent feature of Instant Access presented by Salesforce. Connect with your customers in a whole new way at Salesforce.com. Are you a news watcher? We watch you every morning. Oh, wow. We can find some that great news every morning. We'll give you the real deal news from a real person's perspective. I try to be just as frank on the air as I am right here telling you what's really important. At Papa John's, when it comes to better ingredients, better pizza, we deliver. And now, in addition to delivering a pizza topped with quality ingredients like real meats with no fillers, fresh sliced Roma tomatoes, onions, and green peppers, and fresh never frozen hand-tossed original dough, we're delivering even more value with this special offer. The Colts Fan Feast. Two large, two topping pizzas and a two liter for $22. Promo code BLUE22. 10% of discounted price donated to Riley Children's Foundation. At Huntington, we're always thinking of ways to help business owners. So when we heard they needed help managing their finances, we invented money goggles. <sighs> then we simplified. Presenting the Huntington Hub, our online and mobile banking platform that makes it easier to manage your business's finances. Looking out for you by looking out for your money. Huntington, welcome. Where do I go for personal service that's local? Easy. I-M-C-U. Indiana Members Credit Union. For car or home loans, or even credit cards, I get expert guidance. From someone I know and trust. The service and advice are always excellent. We've been IMCU members for years, and we will be for life. Right now, you can get up to $1,000 off closing costs on 15-year fixed and adjustable rate mortgages at Indiana Members Credit Union. For all your lending needs, choose I-M-C-U. Indiana Members Credit Union. Are you a news watcher? We watch you every morning. Oh, wow. We can find some that great news every morning. We'll give you the real deal news from a real person's perspective. I try to be just as frank on the air as I am right here telling you what's really important. From the Huntington Bank Studio, this is Colts 365. Reggie, congratulations on this incredible honor. You embody what it means to be an Indianapolis Colt. 
it truly was an honor and a privilege to be your teammate and to be your quarterback, and I couldn't be prouder of you. Congratulations again on being inducted into the Colts Ring of Honor. Welcome to The Right Stuff with Colts legend Robert Mathis. Rob, hey, always great to see you, my man. Oh, man, thanks for having me, man. It was a lot of fun, obviously, playing with you throughout the years, getting embarrassed at practice <laughs> when you'd put your spin move on me. But, uh, you know, I, I was thinking, between the two of us here, we have 23 years in the league. Mm. We have 123 sacks. <laughs> we have 54 forced fumbles, and we got five Pro Bowls. Hey, how about that, man? So we got some star hey, power man, here. We got some star power. It's Let's mostly, do it, man. mostly on the left no. side of the table. No, team, team, team. Man. Yeah, hey, no doubt. <laughs> well, uh, how's life on the other side now? Coaching instead of playing. We were talking a little bit off air. Do you get the same adrenaline rush on Sunday afternoons you got when you played? Somewhat. Uh, of course, it's just being around the game, the sport, and the, the team that I love came through the, through the door. And it's, you can't help but to be excited every Sunday right. just to be able to see the guys that's carrying the torch. Mm -hmm. They're carrying the torch well. So I get a big kick out of it. I know my time is up, and I just appreciate watching these guys. You know, you played with a lot of great guys in your years with the Colts. You know, Peyton Manning, Edger and James, Jeff Saturday, mm -hmm. you know, Dallas Clark. But a lot of those guys, you're one of the few that was able to play all 14 seasons in a Colts uniform. How special was that for you to just be able to play with one team? I do not take that for granted in the least bit. It is, it's a rare thing, especially in, you know, in the NFL that you stay in one place mm -hmm. five years, needless to say, 14. So I'm very fortunate, blessed, and humbled and honored to be here 16 years and still going strong. No question. Yeah. How are the hours now coaching versus playing? <laughs> Same, more? <laughs> Man, more, <laughs> a lot more. Uh, it's almost double, sometimes triple. But it's, you st but you love it. You know, I'm around. I'm in my element. You love doing it, and I wouldn't rather be anywhere else. Yep. Another guy you played with, Reggie Wayne, and you guys shared a ton of great wins and memories. Is going into the Ring of Honor this Sunday. How cool will that be for you to to watch that from the sideline? That's going to be great. Uh, one, just one experience when at the 10th anniversary of the 2006 mm -hmm. Super Bowl, just to be around those guys. I was still playing, but it was just some seeing all these guys going down memory lane. Yep. And now you, again, he's going to be in the Hall of Fame, but just to partake in it and just to be around him and call him a brother, friend, yep. it's, it's special. It's yeah, special. no doubt. Well, your time will obviously be coming, <laughs> be coming very soon, so look forward to that. Mm -hmm. Let's take a trip down memory lane a little bit. I'm going to ask you just a couple questions about your okay. playing days, but that's okay. Who is your favorite quarterback to sack? Hands down, Tom Brady. There you go. <laughs> All right, who was the toughest O lineman you had to go off against? The toughest. You don't have to say me. I know you might be thinking I, that. I, but, I, uh, you know, I was going to go there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, in practice, we, we had some good battles. We did. Man. We had some good battles. I'd have to say Walter Jones, man. Okay, Seattle. Seattle. He's, he's, he was tough, man. He yep. was very tough. Okay. Um, what about 2013? Peyton's with the Broncos. When they came back, Sunday night football was such mm -hmm. a circus. But. Talk about your emotions you had when you got the sack fumble in the end zone against 18. Or you, you hadn't been able to hit for a long time. Oh, it was it was special. It was just the, the turn the corner and they said, oh, he still has the ball. <laughs> oh, oh, I cannot mess this up. So I just kind of, I just went for it. And uh, we was able to get a, make a good play. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure, uh, safety or a touchdown yep. or whatever the case, but it was, it was, I understand why guys hate playing against him. Yeah. He is, he is a magician. Yep on that field and uh, just to be able to make a play, it was special. Yeah, we talked about that. You know, when you're playing against her, Tom Brady gets rid of the ball quick. You might beat oh, the old yeah. lineman clean. You get to the quarterback, it's already gone. It's gone. Yeah. <laughs> it's gone. Last question. Four and five right now. You're, you're right in the thick of it with this win. You got two big games coming up and a huge oh, yeah. division game coming up Sunday against the Titans at one. What's your message to the team and specifically your defensive end group going into Sunday? Seize the moment. We, we're kind of on a, on a streak right now, and it just you take it one day at a time. Don't get ahead of yourselves and kind of don't put the cart before the horse. Yep. You take every day, you just approach this day. You just get better. And like Coach Frank says, uh, just get 1% better each day, and the rest will take care of yourself. I feel like I'm getting him off the ground a little bit. I'm just not finishing him into the dirt. <laughs> Nelson might be finishing blocks, but we are not even close to finishing the show. Still to come on Colts 365, it's the wire up that has blown up all over social media. It is sounds of the game with Big Q. Quentin Nelson gets lost in the moment next.
Papa John's offers two large, two topping pizzas and a two liter for $20. Promo code BLUE22. 10% of discounted price donated to Riley's Children's Foundation. Celebrate 35 seasons of Indianapolis Colts football with Arby's and Coca-Cola. Visit your Indianapolis area Arby's and purchase the limited edition Colts Collector's Cup today. Limited supply available. Arby's, we have the meats. Bullseye Event Group's VIP Colts tailgate presented by Hayes and Son is at every Colts home game at the new Bullseye Event Center across the street from Lucas Oil Stadium. Open premium bar, all-you-can-eat food by Food Network celebrity chef Aaron May, who's featured on diners, drive-ins, and dives. Bullseye Event Center is 9,500 square feet of event space with three retractable glass garage doors that open up to decks and green space with dramatic views of Lucas Oil Stadium and the downtown skyline. For the best game day experience, visit bullseyeeventgroup.com. Where do I go for personal service? That's local. Easy. I am the you. Indiana Members Credit Union. For car and home loans, or even credit cards, I get expert guidance from someone I know and trust. The service and advice are always excellent. We've been IMCU members for years, and we will be for life. Time for a new vehicle? Get pre-approved with no application fee at Indiana Members Credit Union. For all your lending needs, choose IMCU. Indiana Members Credit Union. Looking for the perfect gift for that special Colts fan in your life? Fans of all ages can look forward to special events and exclusive benefits for members only when they sign up for one of the official Colts fan clubs. The Colts Kids Club and Blue Ladies offer exciting opportunities, including exclusive gear, special event invites, and more. Log on to Colts.com slash clubs to register today. That's Colts.com slash clubs. Become a member today. The Colts Kids Club is presented by Prairie Farms. From the Huntington Bank Studio, this is Colts 365. Yes, sir. Let's go. Trenches on three. One, two, three. Charges. Yes, sir. You got the body. You got the body to embarrass every play. Do it. Yep. Oh God! Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! Luke Rhodes, he's just chilling. Right, let's do it, baby. Let's do it. Love you, I got you. Love you too. And Luck's gonna loft it downfield, wide open. Eric Ebron catches it in stride. He's inside the 20, still going, diving for the pylon. Touchdown, Eric Ebron. That's how you start the game. Yeah. Hey. Ebron. Go! I was like right on your back, like pushing you. Were you a little slow to get out? I took three steps and then there was a guy right there in my face as soon as I got there. Yeah, the corner. Just take one. Uh, yeah, I took three steps. I got you. <laughs> I was like pushing your back a little bit. Okay, whatever you gotta do. <laughs> Steps up, has time to throw. He's going to wing it downfield. Wide open, T.Y. Inside Jaguar territory, down the far sideline. Push out of bounds at the 35. First down and a huge play over the middle to T.Y. Hilton. Good, hey, good call. I saw the backer look, walk up. Yeah, baby. Here's a sweep left side to Eric Ebron. He gets in, touchdown, a touchdown, a rushing touchdown. Yeah! yeah. Ryan, Ryan! Quick pitch.
catch it right side of Jordan Wilkins. He's got a first down and more. <laughs> Stick up for each other, but don't do anything stupid. Good work, baby. That's on them. Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. Touchdown! Touchdown! A 12-yard pass. Wide open was Eric Ebron. <laughs> Dude, that was weak. You're tired. One thing I want you to do is like, when I come over and hit him, I want you to try to like rip him. Cause like, I feel like I'm getting him off the ground a little bit. I'm just not finishing him into the dirt. Hey, finish, finish, finish these guys. Every play. Dude, super hard? Dude, that was a good call. I push you in the back to give you some no, momentum. No. Are you cool with that? Yes. Cool. <laughs> Gonna lob it to the end zone, going up and making the catch. Touchdown, Mo Ali Cox! Dude, let's go! Woo! Hey, come together. Everyone, let's go. Do your job. Come on. AC. Hey, we're finishing this game. We're ending with the ball in our hands. Bortles has time over the middle. Connects with Rashad Green. And they're going to say Green caught the ball to the 25. He let loose of it right at the tail end of his catch. Ball's out! So the under two-minute review now coming from upstairs in the booth. Ball's out! At the review in the play. Yeah! We're going to be a the ball. Let's go! Come on. Let's go, baby. Ready? That's the ball game. The Colts have won it in week number 10, their third straight win. Good win, man. Still a win. Yep. <laughs> Give me some. Hey, that, was a, that was an interesting game, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Still to come on Colts 365, it is our final thoughts as the Colts look to go four in a row and knock off another division opponent. A message from your local Meyer. Local sports are a victory for our entire community. Building leaders, teaching integrity, sparking our economy. That's why Meyer is proud to sponsor local sports throughout Indiana. Because when we support the home team, we all win. Where do I go for personal service that's local? Easy. I M C U. Indiana Members Credit Union. For car or home loans, or even credit cards, I get expert guidance from someone I know and trust. The service and advice are always excellent. We've been IMCU members for years, and we will be for life. Right now, you can get up to $1,000 off closing costs on 15-year fixed and adjustable rate mortgages at Indiana Members Credit Union. For all your lending needs, choose IMCU. Indiana Members Credit Union. At Papa John's, when it comes to better ingredients, better pizza, we deliver. And now, in addition to delivering a pizza topped with quality ingredients like real meats with no fillers, fresh sliced Roma tomatoes, onions, and green peppers, and fresh, never frozen, hand tossed original dough, we're delivering even more value with this special offer. The Colts Fan Feast. Two large, two topping peaches and a two liter for $22. Promo code BLUE22. 10% of discounted price donated to Riley Children's Foundation. Lucas Oil Stadium is celebrating its 10th anniversary, an entire decade of incredible memories. Now it's time for us to make you the star with a Colt sidecar experience. One winner will receive four sideline passes and ride in the Colts motorcycle sidecar to lead the team onto the field. Sign up at participating AutoZones or Rickers stores. And while you're there, check out Lucas Oil's entire lineup of problem-solving additives to keep your car running smooth and strong. For full details, visit lucasoil.com slash wincolts. This is the middle, a place where people come together, look each other in the eye, and get to work. 
where people believe in more, like they can always do a little more, give a little more, and find ways for their families to have a little more. We were born and raised here, and for over 80 years, we've done whatever we can to help people have and do a little more. It's now time for the Forum Question of the Week. How many times did Reggie Wayne have 200 or more yards receiving in a single game during his 14 seasons with the Colts? Wayne hit the 200-yard mark three times, including a career-high 221 yards and a 2004 playoff game against the Broncos. Forum Credit Union, helping members live their financial dreams. From the Huntington Bank Studio, this is Colts 365. Hi, I'm John Corbin. Huntington Bank is proud to be the official bank of the Indianapolis Colts. Welcome to this Colts 365 in the Community Moment presented by Huntington Bank. Earlier this week, Lucas Oil Stadium played host to the 8th annual Million Meal Marathon to help fight hunger. The Colts, along with UPS and Defenders, teamed up with the Million Meal Movement. The goal? To pack one million nutritious meals for Indiana's hungry in a single day. Colts alumni players, cheerleaders, and volunteers from companies around Central Indiana, along with several thousand community members, transformed the exhibit halls at Lucas Oil to assembly lines, where each volunteer packed around 200 meals each hour. The meals will be distributed to local food banks across Indiana, providing a stable, nutritious base to those who are in need. As we get closer and closer to kickoff, we are going to end the show with the Speedway scouting report. With the Tennessee Titans coming to town, our final thoughts, what we need to see the Colts do. Marlon, what do you want to see? Well, I, I want to see from our offense consistency, right? We, we play great. We've had a great stretch going. Three games we won. But on offense, last week we were a bit inconsistent. Started yeah. very fast, very strong in the first half. We came out and kind of sputtered yeah. the second half. We had to be bailed out by our defense again with the key turnover to win the game. So defensively, more of that, please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Serve more of that, more turnovers. And then it's just containing that quarterback, Mariota. Yeah. We know that he's dangerous, and he's proven that he can actually beat us from the pocket. So we have to have that, that pass rush, get after him, uh, create some chaos in the backfield, and turn over that football so we can win this football game. Yeah, we were talking earlier in the show of how this defense, I think for the first time in a couple of years, we've been able to say, well, the Tennessee Titans defense is, is pretty dang good. Yeah. They're actually yeah. ranked number six overall, and if there was one weakness, it's – the run they, they can't quite stop the run so, as well as they are the pass so come on Marlon Mack, Marlon Mack. Yeah, come on, Marlon right? Mack. Let, Marlon yeah, Mack. The, the men up front have been doing their job for the last couple of weeks let's get another game um, of dominating the fronts yeah. and then getting that run game going so we are excited for the Tennessee Titans to come to town another AFC South matchup and not to mention former teammate here Reggie of Marlon Wayne. Reggie Wayne going That's into right. the ring of honor it's going to be an exciting weekend we hope you enjoyed this week's show from Caroline Cam from Marlon Jackson everyone here at Coles 365. We will see you again next week, same time, same place.